And the latest effort to recall California Governor Newsom heating up with hundreds of thousands of signatures already collected. Here's one America's Pearson Sharp. Recall Gavin! Recall Gavin! Recall Gavin! Re While the media tries to ignore the recall of Governor Gavin Newsom, the people of California aren't. And the latest effort to remove the do-nothing governor is booming. Petitions for Recall Gavin 2020 are pouring in from across the state, with organizers telling One America News they have more than half a million signatures already. Some 600,000 have reportedly been collected well on the way to the 1.5 million required by mid-November. Not only that, but along with endorsements from both the California GOP and Libertarian parties, millionaire businessman and former candidate for governor John Cox is promoting the recall and has made a more than six-figure donation to the campaign. A lot of it is really organic. That's the yeah. amazing thing is that people nice. are going on their own to recall Gavin 2020, printing out the petitions and getting themselves to wherever they can, even if it's just in their own pod of family and friends, because they're really motivated. But why are Californians so eager to get Newsom out of office? Well, after just over a year in power, so far, Gavin Newsom has managed to dramatically raise taxes. He's promoted sanctuary cities. He suspended the death penalty, which Californians voted for. He's protected criminals and actively prevents illegal aliens from being deported. Newsom is still trying to spend billions of dollars on a train to nowhere. He reduced border security. He fought President Trump's efforts to build a wall and supported legislation punishing California companies who do work on the wall and he even tried to remove President Trump from the ballots for the 2020 election. Newsom left his own winery open long after all the other non-essential businesses and wineries were forced to close. He has endorsed even stricter gun laws to take guns away from law-abiding citizens. He signed SB 145 into law, making it easier than ever for pedophiles to prey on children. He's sitting back and doing nothing to stop a law restricting Californians to just 55 gallons of water a day, which will go into effect in just over a year. He's destroyed countless independent contractors in the state with a disastrous AB5, and he killed tens of thousands of businesses across the state, leaving millions out of work with his oppressive and nonsensical response to the coronavirus. Considering he's left so many people out of work, homelessness is also skyrocketing under Newsom. In 2019 alone, the state's homeless population rose 16%. Since Gavin Newsom has been in office, I think there's very few Californians, if any, who could say their life has gotten better. Um, and if you don't like the way life is going now, if we don't call Gavin Newsom, it's going to be headed in the same direction. Recall organizers say anyone who's interested can visit the site recallgavin2020.com to download and sign a petition or donate money and contribute to the cause. Mike explained that donations go a long way to making the recall effective, and even if you don't live in California, helping stop the state's radicalism can keep it from spreading across the country. The effort must collect roughly 2 million signatures to remove the governor. And Mike says for simply the price of a postage stamp, Californians could see a new governor in office by next March. But it won't happen unless California residents get active right now. He urged them to talk to their family and friends, to go door to door and talk to their neighbors and share the petition far and wide on social media. Sign now. Don't wait. Get out there, sign now, get your friends to sign now. This is a matter, if there's ever been an urgent political matter in the history of California and frankly in the history of the country, act now. We want to get this done now. Pearson Sharp, One America News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.